Welcome everyone, it is Andrew here from Apple Insider. And you may think you know how to wash your hands, but do you? With watchOS 7, Apple Watch is going to help you wash your hands to make sure you are doing it long enough to kill any germs that may be sticking around. Let's take a look at this, going into the settings, the health app, and everything you need to know about washing your hands with Apple Watch and watchOS 7. First, there is a setting that you can toggle on and off. If you head into the settings app on your Apple Watch and scroll down quite a bit, you'll see an option for hand washing. When you open that, you can disable or enable hand washing in general, and you can turn on or off the haptics. The haptics start by tapping you when you start washing your hands and tap you again on the wrist when you're complete. The idea is that every time you wash your hands, it should be for at least 20 seconds. An Apple Watch knows this based on the movements of your hand that it recognizes as hand washing, as well as the sound of rushing water coming out of the faucet when you are washing your hands. We've been testing this for a few weeks now, and it's surprisingly accurate at how quickly it picks up washing your hands and counting down that timer. It's really easy actually to see the countdown in our mirror so we don't even have to stop to look at our watch. Whenever you stop washing your hands to take a peek, it'll let you know how far you are. Cute little bubble animations everywhere. And it'll give you like a little feedback saying just a little bit more, or almost there, or something along those lines to let you know that you still have a few seconds longer to complete washing your hands. And when you're done, it gives you an all done notice, again with all those cute little bubble animations and it records all that information to the health app over on your iPhone. Now there are a few fringe case scenarios. First, it doesn't always pick it up right away. It could take five to seven seconds before it starts noticing. Like in this case here, it didn't really pick it up right away, but by the time it did, it had moved the countdown to about seven or five seconds in. The idea again being that it started to detect it right away but wasn't sure so it was kind of recording but not recording and then once it said yes this is hand washing we're going to go ahead and credit you for that 5 or 7 seconds before we actually display the timer. That way you don't have this popping up all the time in case it starts to detect hand washing and it in fact is not hand washing. We did have it pop up a few times inadvertently as well. A big uh, Kind of culprit of this was washing dishes. It would pop up a few times washing dishes and let us know, hey, you're not doing enough. And that definitely killed our average from time to time. Now, if you do stop early, say you only went a few seconds in there, it'll say nearly there and give you that not time left. Then it gives you this warning. Washing your hands for 20 seconds can kill germs that might make you sick. So letting you know that you did not wash your hands long enough and what might happen if you don't do it. As we said, all this data is recorded in the health app over on your iPhone. If you go to the health app and go to the new section for hand washing, you'll see all of your data come in. In this case, you can see it the day, week, month, and year, just as you'd expect. And as you can kind of see here, other than the first couple days when we were testing it, we've trended longer. What typically was the case for us is we were washing our hands for about 15 seconds or so, and the Apple Watch has actually kept us going longer, seeing us go, oh, we're at 15 seconds, I need to go to 20 seconds. So we would go a little bit further than we would before. The Apple Watch has actually helped us wash our hands longer than we ever did in the past. Of course, there's a whole hand washing article as well in the health app that gives you more tips on how to wash your hands correctly, uh, different ways to do it, you don't have soap, use hand sanitizer, all the kind of the guidelines that you need to properly wash your hands. Because shockingly enough, before the COVID outbreak, a lot of people did not know the best ways to wash your hands or how long to wash your hands. Just kind of the general stuff of maybe singing happy birthday to yourself along those lines. But Apple Watch definitely makes it easier to do. Hand washing on Apple Watch has been development for years before the global pandemic outbreak and you can definitely tell how well Apple has done it. Let me know what you guys think over on Twitter. Find me at Andrew underscore OSU. Hey everyone, did you guys like that video? Be sure to click on that like button so we can create content that we know that you guys wanna see. And follow Apple Insider on all social media channels. If you want the best prices on any Apple gear, check out the Apple Insider price guide that is updated daily. And until next time, we'll see you later.